the 3 Series might be BMW's iconic touchstone, but the X3 is fast becoming its lodestone. The sales figures tell the story. In the nine months through September 2017, BMW sold 32,127 X3s in the US It still sold more 3 Series over the same period, 43,215, but it's the trend, not the number, that's important. X3 sales were up 3.6% year-on-year while 3 Series sales were down 18.6%. And that's not an anomaly, in 2016 3 Series sales finished 25.5% down on 2015 while X3 sales were up 38.4%. The center of gravity is shifting at BMW. The third-generation X3 is therefore a critically important new vehicle for the Bavarian automaker. One in three BMWs sold worldwide these days carries an X badge, and BMW clearly expects the X3 to soon supplant the X5 as the company's most popular SUV, having announced plans to augment production out of Spartanburg, South Carolina, with new X3 assembly lines in South Africa and China opening in 2018. The new X3 is slightly larger and roomier than its predecessor, as you'd perhaps expect, but more importantly, it feels a more mature vehicle to drive, quieter and more composed on the road, and laden with BMW's latest technology. You can tell this is a product that's now core to the BMW brand. The first of the new X3s will arrive in US BMW dealers next month. Two models will initially be available, the $43,445 X3 xDrive 30i, powered by the 248-horsepower-258 pound FT turbocharged i4 and the $55,295 X3 M40i, the first ever M Performance X3 variant, with a 355-horsepower-369 pound FT version of the 3.0-liter turbocharged i6 under the hood and a bunch of sport-oriented mechanical components and appearance items. The X3 xDrive 30D powered by the 3.0-liter i6 turbo diesel with 261 horsepower and a hulking 457 pounds FT of torque from 2000 to 2500 RPMs, will join the lineup in 2018.